Officials offered free community testing for COVID-19 in Monroe County for the first time today. Newswatch reporter Jacob Comer visited the site to find out more. Today for the first time, community testing was offered in Monroe County in the town of Linside. According to the Monroe County Health Department Administrator, testing has always been available in the county, but this marks the first time that the county has deliberately focused on more rural and vulnerable populations. Now this is the first community event that we've done. Now we do testing every day. Um, we uh, work with Monroe Health Center, which is located um, in Peterstown Union, and we have um, sites in Forest Hill and also in Virginia, and we do testing every day there. The goal of the free rapid testing is to simply encourage more people to get tested. And according to Teresa White with the West Virginia Division of Homeland Security, the entire country is seeing more and more cases every day, so it's important now more than ever to get tested if you haven't yet, even if you don't think you're sick. I think it's extremely important that everybody be tested because of the asymptomatic factor that's in there. Um, you could be going around and unbeknownst to you spreading the virus and not even realize that you have it. Even if you don't have the virus or are asymptomatic, it's still important to continue to protect yourself and others. You could contract the virus at any time and be contagious without even realizing it. So protecting others by wearing a face mask is a necessity in public spaces. You can do protective measures in the meantime, wearing a mask, and um, if you have to go in somewhere, just keeping socially distanced from people and mainly just um, using some common sense. The testing was free for everyone, including people without health insurance or those that don't even live in Monroe County. The next county to have free community testing provided by the state and local government will be Lincoln County on June 29th. This has been Jacob Comer reporting for WOAY Newswatch. Ongoing effort by the state to provide more testing opportunities for minorities and vulnerable populations.